bitty bitty banda is electricity personified. Why Selena? She's always been so special to me, especially being a person from Texas. To have that small thing that I can share with other people, to know that they love Selena too. Bye everybody, Bitty Bitty Banda, and this is our story. Bitty Bitty Banda is a Selena tribute from Austin and San Antonio, Texas. It features some of Texas' most up-and-coming, incredible Tejano players. We play everything in the key of Selena, so everything is in its original version. We're really proud of the fact that we present this music live, and we want you to close your eyes and feel like you're at a Selena show. So Bitty Bitty Banda's first version was nine players. Our first show was at Empire Control Room. I thought it was just gonna be something that flew under the radar, nobody was gonna, like, it's just like a cool Selena thing. We sold the show out. Seeing the excitement in people's faces, hearing Selena songs live for the first time, I was like, this rush of like, oh, we're onto something big here. This is gonna be big. This is gonna be, this is gonna change my life. And it did. There are Selena fans everywhere. And it's almost like a, like a secret little friendship bracelet that we have that we can share with other people, you know, and someone always has a Selena story for me. It's so special and it feels like we're sharing this unspoken bond with another person or another entity. She's incredibly special. I completely acknowledge her energy and her legacy as a part of a much bigger thing than just me and Bitty Bitty Banda. When you don't see people who look like you, doing the things you want to do and making your dreams come true, making these awesome things happen, it almost seems like it's not possible. I can say from experience, we've played a lot of places where people will reach out to us and be like, we're thinking of doing a Latin night and we know Selena's going to do well. What I don't want to do is go into a place where we, that you experiment with your Latin night and then you never call a band of color other, ever again, or you only call us once a year. That's not helping the greater good. In 2020, we incorporated an inclusion rider which says that we will only play shows that support other women of color, um, the LGBTQ community, and you know we believe all lives can't matter until Black Lives Matter significantly more. This is all part of our narrative now, and we won't play a show where someone doesn't feel like that. Those things matter as much as we feel like they matter. Getting to talk to young ladies, members of the LGBTQ community, women, older, younger, and having them say, I've never seen anything like this before. I've never seen this music done live before. Hearing how special that is, is definitely a driving force in what makes the, the banda so special. And so, yeah, but when the door is cracked open, we really want to kick it down and make sure that people who look like us also have those opportunities. <laughs>